Before I get started with this video, bro, I just want to bring y'all some news. Your boy has finally hit 1,000 subs on YouTube. Man, y'all had me in here about the same the old rich homie bro, I was in this bit. They think I'm sponsored by Olympics. Nah, baby, this an outing. What's a hundred times ten? Nigga, keep it one. Keep that one thousand. Hey, I, I was hyped, bro. I was elated, bro. I was proud. I never thought my channel would hit this milestone. I always thought I would either flop really bad or just go big. I went. I didn't think I'd have like this steady improvement like over time. But I've been doing YouTube for about about a year now. Almost a year. Yeah, a little over, probably a little over a year. I'm not even sure when. I think I started like in uh, like late 2018 or so. But I didn't think I would hit this. But thank you guys. I'm, I appreciate y'all so much. I love y'all so much, man. We have many more milestones to hit. Maybe when I hit that 10K, I can say that Drake, hey, 10 band, 50 band, 100 band. Hey, just, we, 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 we out there, bro. We up. Appreciate y'all, man. Appreciate y'all so much. Sub, like. Hit that notification bell, bro. Keep subbing. Keep liking the videos. Keep watching. I appreciate y'all. All right, I'm out. Yo, what is up, y'all? What's the deal? I have a very quick video for you guys today. I want to talk to you all about why your jump shot is ice freaking cold. And no, it has nothing to do with the weather. It has nothing to do with the Christmas update. But I'm going to get into a few details on why your jump shot is an honorary member of 1017 Brick Squad. So... I really brought this video today for you guys for me to uh, review the new jump shot I went over. But I'm going to go over a few things that probably keeps you from being a very good shooter on NBA 2K. And the first thing I want to talk about is we never change our jump shots. We get too enamored with certain jump shots because they're consistent for a little while. But 2K always drops update after update after update. And it messes with jump shots primarily. I was so in love with uh, the KD jump shot. That's my new jump shot, the 80 with the KD release. But I was so in love with the KD jump shot because it was so consistent for a good period of time through multiple patches. And when you find a jump shot that is good through multiple patches, you never want to change it. So I challenge you. See, I was hitting whites, bro. I never hit whites. I never hit whites. I always is green or nothing. But I just want to challenge you guys. If you haven't changed your jump shot all year, go find you a new jumper. Just go change it. Even if your jump shot that you're currently using is decent, I just want to challenge you guys to change your jump shot. And another thing I want you to do is optimize your settings and your controller settings. And what I mean by this, I want you to go to your settings first and change your shot meter to white, your shot meter, and your fatigue meter. I always want that always. See, mine was on back on team color and I haven't switched mine back to team color in so long. So I don't even know how that was on there. So I'm switching that back to white. I don't know if that's a mind game. Like I told you guys in the video a long time ago, but I always feel like it helps me when I turn it to white. Even if you don't have your shot meter on, I recommend you taking it off if you have mastered your jump shot. But you might want to test your new jump shot out with the shot meter on for a little while. But once you take that off, it still does help you to change that to white because you're fatigued. You still have a fatigue meter. But those are the settings that I usually use. And if you guys like the Christmas drip, bro, I might make a Christmas drip uh, video, man. If you like what I got on, I had to put them on a sweater because I ain't want my guy catching pneumonia out there. And always go check your badge because your badge probably turn, uh, change around when you switch players a lot or something like that. So I seen my badges change one time when I switched my players. But I'm going to show you guys the direct game. The direct game is just going to show you what my jump shot, my new jump shot is looking like. And I also want to mention another reason why your jump shot might be tripping. Is you probably play on Wi-Fi. It's like me. I play on Wi-Fi. And a lot of times I'm delayed, bro. As you're going to see in one of these clips where... Uh, I catch the ball and it's literally only in scoring position, bro. When it hits me with those lag spikes, I'll catch the ball like wide open and it'll hit me with a spike and I can't even shoot the dang ball. My team makes a piss, I'm pissed. Why well, not mad at me like for not taking the shot? But you just, you just know it's kind of annoying, bro. Like you, I, I messed up there since. You seen how I just like got that big spike and I had to pass the ball to the guy next to me. But that's, uh, I hate that, bro. And people still think I can't rebound, bro. That's why I'm putting all these rebound clips up in here. People think I can't rebound still, man. I don't know why people think I can't rebound. I've made countless videos on rebounding, countless tips on rebounding. I can rebound, bro. I'm small, I'm undersized, but I still can rebound. So I'm just putting some a few rebound clips up in there just to show you guys. Because you guys, I think some people said start including rebounding clips when I make my mixtapes and stuff. So I'll probably put those in there when I make my mixtape to show you guys some more uh, rebounding stuff. But we about to get to the shot. I know I made the video talking about the jump shot. I haven't shot a single jump shot. But here comes my first one. I'm going to go duck off in the corner real quick and give me a good shot in. And 
my that was my first time shooting the 80 kd in the game i haven't shot it in the game without using actual anthony davis the player so that was my first time getting a feel of that shot and it felt perfectly bro when i had when i shot it that first time very good jump shot man I, i'm liking it just off that first shot so we're going to see how that how that goes the rest of this game but i was playing pretty good in this red game bro it's only like the second quarter and i'm i got 10 and 9 playing a very good game it was a pretty easy game i don't think that guy was a bad player that i was matched up against but when i got like three or more people in the wreck that i know it's pretty much a a blowout every time like i don't like just going in the wreck and just playing like you know against scrubs or whatever with a full team but i didn't have a full team we had like some rams on the team uh, i don't know that guy with that fro and uh yeah i think that's it we had four and we took and we had one random but I'm out there looking like Nikolai Jokic, handling the ball in transition, making plays, rebounding. They're doing a little bit of everything out there. This was my first game back in a while, in probably like a few days. I hadn't played 2K that much. Like I told you guys, I'm playing on Wi-Fi. My connection is very, very inconsistent. And these are probably the worst servers in, on 2K since like, I would say 2K17. These servers are pretty bad. So uh, pair that with my not so good internet connection, then you have a shit storm of lag delay and just everything in between bro but i don't know how few and far between these shots are but i've come across a lot of clips and i haven't shot my second jump shot yet but i know it's gonna be like a really deep three as if i can remember it was like from the sea almost i hear you i think this is it right here yeah i shot that bitch from the sea and that's another green man very good shot bro i'm loving this shot so this is getting close to the end of the video. This is my last jump shot right here. So I went three for three for three. I had more clips, but I didn't save them. And I want that. I want you guys to do. I was gonna do a Q and A for my uh my 1,000 subscriber video. So leave me questions below. Any questions you want to ask me, leave it below, and I'm sure to answer it in my Q and A video, which is gonna be my 1,000 subscriber special. But that's the end of the uh, video, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace. Let it play, boy.